Made in Hollywood. Nikolai Kostiwalda stars as a successful businessman whose life is transformed forever by the American prison system in the crime thriller Shot Caller. Hey guys, I'm Nikolai Kostiwalda. You're watching Made in Hollywood. Here's a scene from my new movie, Shot Caller. I honestly don't think that baseball constitutes a date night. But there are dugout club seats on yeah, the third base. No it's, it's romantic and they're, what? And they're free. Right? Yeah, that's okay. right. Probably. All right. <laughs> I need the light. <laughs> so you decided in your downtime from Game of Thrones to make a frightening movie. Mm -hmm. Why? Why do this? I thought it was a great script, a great story. I, I you know, I, I love those kinds of movies where you go, well, what if, if, if I was in his shoes, what would I do? And, and, and it's a very simple thing, you know, it, it, it could happen to most of us. You know, we all make those little silly mistakes, you know, he had a glass of wine, he shouldn't have a glass of wine, but you know, it's just a, it's just a two mile drive home, I'll be fine. But we all are guilty of bending the rules and could have been about having a couple of glasses of wine, it could have been texting and driving, it could have been just not paying attention, period. And it's like we take things for granted how fast our lives can change. I'm not looking for trouble. The fact is, a place like this forces us to become warriors or victims. I understand why he made the choice. And when he gets in there, the first thing he sees is that another rookie inmate is raped. I mean, that will put the fear in you. And that's the whole thing. I think this whole constant fear. You're living in fear, and fear will make you do crazy things. The only thing that matters is you getting home to your family in one piece. You know, I can also understand that he goes, okay, I'll, 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 I'll shake hands with, with the devil now, but it's fine. It's only gonna be until I'm out. I'm just gonna get through this. You'll get your hands dirty like the rest of us. But most of us would probably like to think, yeah, no, if it was me, I would just, you know, I'll be the lone wolf, I'll be on my own. And I think it's, it's a lot to ask. If you if you're not from that world, I always want to be a part of different genres of, of film. In the genre of uh, of a film that's about incarceration, I wanted to be one of the enforcers, one of the ones that were uh, commanding, barking, setting the rules. And, and I thought it was you know Rick Romanwald did a phenomenal job at, at creating that that environment for me. These cops think the more they lock us down and isolate us. It strips us of our power. They're dead wrong. It became this lightning rod idea that I wanted to give you a first person point of view of going inside that world. I wasn't about to commit a crime to try to get myself in there, so I thought the next um, best thing to do was to become a volunteer with the Department of Corrections in California working in parole. You were basically undercover. Yes, sir. And that experience was what in your head? Realizing are there monsters in prison? You're damn right there are. There are people who should never get out and see the light of day again but there are a tremendous amount of human beings. It's funny, I met a guy who, who, who had been a shot caller, and he was, uh, he had all the tats, and a lot of it was covered up because he, he was no longer inside. This, all this, it's just the armor. I just tried to, I, I want to put the fear in you. And I said, well, it works. Before you say another word, think of your family in this decision. What I'm trying to do is show you the controversy warts and all on the 50 yard line so that hopefully people can have a debate about it and start humanizing the issues so that people understand both sides of it and try to get something out of it and hopefully lessen the load of our prison population. It's just exploding. Nobody's touching my family.